Welcome back to Vision Edge, where we explore tech that shapes tomorrow. Today we tackle a hot topic. Artificial intelligence, its power, potential, and pitfalls. We'll unpack insights from one of the leading voices in AI-enabled coding, Amjad Massad, CEO of Replit, sharing the stage with Joe Rogan. Joe, clip. I'm really curious what's the best case scenario for AI. What is Replit? Amjad Massad founded Replit, a cloud-native platform designed to simplify programming by enabling you to write, run, and share code all from your browser. It's shaping up to become an education super hub and developer playground. Cut to short overlay of Replit in action, launching a Python project in under 10 seconds. Real-time multiplayer coding. Code completion powered by AI extensions. During the podcast, Joe and Amjad discuss how tools like this are ushering in the age of AI augmented coding. Gone are the days when you had to learn. Every syntax rule AI can handle the heavy lifting, letting you focus on ideas. Two, AI as creative partner. One core theme, AI doesn't replace you, it empowers you. If you can sketch a concept, AI can help code it. Joe and Amjad examine the synergy human creativity plus AI reliability. Joe, so you just start typing an idea and it writes the whole thing? Amjad, exactly. It's like having a second brain. Imagine pitching an app concept in natural language boom. AI scaffolds your prototype. This lowers entry barriers, enabling more people to build, innovate, and solve problems. Democratizing coding, removing gatekeepers like expensive IDEs or steep learning curves. Three societal ripples in ethics. But AI isn't all sunshine. Joe shifts the conversation to misuse, bias, data scraping, and deep fakes. Amjad stresses that tools are neutral. Responsibility lies with us. Amjad, none of this is magic. It's just patterns in data. Garbage in, garbage out. They also tackle copyright concerns. Massive data sets? scraped without explicit consent. The path ahead, transparent, ethical data, thoughtful regulation, and community-driven oversight. Best case scenario for AI. Then Joe asks the million-dollar question. What's the best case scenario? Amjad, it's us plus AI. Think of AI as a universal assistant tutoring a child in math, translating a poem, prototyping a startup idea, or discovering cures. In this vision, no more rote learning AI tutors adapt to each student. Creativity is unleashed, hobbyists become innovators. Global collaboration flourishes, language and tech barriers dissolve. Massad likens it to a creativity supercharger. He rejects dystopian AI takeover narratives, framing the real risk as stagnation or leaving behind those who don't adapt. 5. Real-world impact and Replit's role. Joe and Amjad dive into Replit's mission, leveling the playing field. Whether you're in a developing country, without expensive hardware, you can code via browser, share work instantly, learn from others, and collaborate in real time. They discuss community-generated repls, peer feedback loops, and how collective intelligence boosts learning. AI also helps by auto-formatting code, optimizing practices, fixing bugs instantly not writing dry tech manuals. Challenges ahead. But it's not all smooth. They highlight job displacement versus job evolution. Repetitive roles may vanish. But new ones AI trainers, ethicists, prompt engineers will arise. Data privacy. Whose code, whose data? That needs clarity. Equity. Ensuring global access, not just profitable regions. Amjad encourages responsible scaling, education-first AI, and open AI infrastructure. Avoiding black box systems. Entire industries can't audit. What viewers can do. So what can you do to influence this future? 
One, learn a little code, enough to understand and use AI tools wisely. Two, engage ethically, don't plagiarize data sets or build surveillance. Advocate responsibly, demand transparency in AI platforms or support equitable access. Use tools that prioritize open, community-backed initiatives. In their closing segment, Joe summarizes, AI, when guided, is our ally, not our overlord. It's up to us to shape how we integrate it into society, education, creativity, and work. Joe, that's the best-case scenario AI amplifying humanity. We need to do this right. Why this episode matters. Uno personal. Relatable insights, Joe's curiosity grounds. Technical discussion in real world hopes and fears. Two, practical inspiration. Concrete examples of how you can use AI tools now. Three, balanced caution. It's not hype or paranoia. It's nuanced conversation about growth with guardrails. AI isn't a distant sci-fi concept. It's already transforming how we learn, create, and collaborate. The best case scenario? A future where anyone, anywhere, can tap into AI-driven tools to bring ideas to life. But this requires intentional stewardship balancing innovation with ethics, equity, and community. In this episode of The Joe Rogan Experience, R2344, Joe Rogan interviews Amjad Massad, the founder and CEO of Replit, a leading cloud-based coding platform. They dive deep into the current and future landscape of AI, exploring how it intersects with programming, creativity, ethics, and society at large. Core themes covered. 1. AI-powered development tools. How AI is revolutionizing coding workflows. 2. Ethical and societal challenges, including bias, misinformation, and regulatory questions. 3. The best case scenario for AI. A vision where AI augments human potential, not replaces it. Four, future of education and collaboration. Democratizing access through platforms like Replit, 